does not provide any codes that could help to isolate the culprit. While the message itself seems to be indicating the problematic point, Ethernet adapter. First let's update network adapter drivers. Right click on Windows button, select Device Manager. In newly opened window in the list Expand Network Adapters category, right click on your network adapter and select Update Driver. Then select to update driver software automatically and wait for the process to finish. After this, check if the problem is still there. Now let's try reinstalling your network adapter. Right click on Windows button, select Device Manager. In newly opened window in the list Expand Network Adapters category, right click on your network adapter and select Uninstall Device and click Uninstall button to confirm the action. After this, in the menu of Device Managers window click on Action and select to scan for hardware changes. Windows will automatically reinstall the device. Now let's try resetting your network in general. Click on Windows button, then click on Settings. In newly open window click on Network and Internet option, then at the bottom of the window click on Network Reset and confirm the action by clicking Reset button. Wait for the process to finish and restart your PC. Now let's check the dependency services of the wireless LAN auto config. Press Windows key with letter R simultaneously. Then type in the given command and press enter. In newly opened window in the list locate WLAN auto config service entry and double click on it. Then navigate to dependencies tab and make sure all the services that are under remote procedure call category have their startup type set to automatically. For this method let's reset the WinSock entries and TCP IP stack. Right click on Windows button, select Command Prompt Admin. In Command Prompt Environment type the given commands one by one, each followed by pressing Enter. Wait for the process to finish and restart your PC. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos.